it's so um, it's got to be so hard for April Lida. That's the mom who's here to be living this for all of us who have kids. Uh, you know, we've we've heard our kids uh, be like that, but never in circumstances like this. April, I'm so sorry for what's happened to your family, um, and I appreciate you trying to help us all figure it out. How are you doing? Um, I'm okay. I'm just hanging in there. One day at a time. I know you got a little one at home and you're trying to figure out how to help your 12 year old. Uh, what have you been able to make sense of in terms of how this happened? Um, from what we found it, it looks like it was a medication issue, not anything else. It's just like a manic episode of some kind. Um, help, from a help me understand. ADHD how, help me understand. So she was on an ADHD, uh, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, very common for parents out there. They'll hear about it. Um, they always, they come with indications, but there's usually guidance about, well, you may start seeing things. Was this part of a downturn or a spiral? Was there any other behavior that gave you any indication that the kid was unstable? No. She was fine. She wasn't unstable until she was put back on the medication. So she was, she was on, the on the medication. She hurt herself. What happened to take her off it? She um, cut her arms within a month of being back on it. So I immediately took her off after speaking to the school um, and her doctor and herself. We had a long conversation. Um, she said that she felt like she was really irritated, irritable, angry for no reason on the medication. So, of course, I took her off of it. Um, unfortunately, it was too late. The damage was done. Stuff like this can um, can happen months or even years after being off of a medication like this. So she was on the medication. You took her off. She went back on. She started to self-harm. You took her off again. Um, what did the doctors tell you about why going on or off was the right thing? Were they in favor of taking her off both times? Well, the first time I took her off, it was my decision and Jalen's decision because she was being homeschooled at the time and she wanted to see if she could do it without her medication because the only reason why she was on that medication was because she was having a hard time concentrating with 20, 25 other kids. We were homeschooling that year, and I told her that was fine. We can try it out, and see if she does well on it. And uh, if she does, she'll, con you know, she'll continue to not have to take it. But like I said, um, a year, a year and a half later, she went back to public school, and um, the the doctor recommended putting her back on it because her grades were slipping. And so I did. I put her back on it, and then um, a few weeks later, a month later, she cut her arms. So that's when I was told to take her back off of it, which I did immediately. So she was on it for five years straight. And we only took her off of it because she wanted to see if she could go without it and do her schoolwork without it. Did she stop cutting herself when you took her off? Uh, yeah, she, she only cut herself that one time. And then the night right before she attacked my son, she cut her arm again. But she had and not then... self-harmed before or after that. And then, and I'm sorry, but I mean, you know, I know you're trying to figure this out and um, it's all just about trying to understand how so that you can get her the help that she needs. Um, with her brother, what was the relationship like before this happened in January? They were close. They've always been close. It's always been just us three until three years ago. Um, they did yoga together almost every night. They went on vacations together and trips together. They always sat next to each other. They were very close. She loved him and he loved her. Was she able to tell you what led to her stabbing him? She has no idea why she did it. She's heartbroken and she feels very guilty, but she still doesn't understand why she did it. She said it was like it wasn't her. And um, the team of specialists working with her, they, they believe her after working with her for the last six months every day. 
and I believe her too because I know my child and I know that was a her. Hey, thank you for watching. Please go to newsnationnow.com, newsnationnow.com, and you can find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button down below. Then you will get more of News Nation's fact-driven coverage.